Hello, Georgia B back again. Happy New Year to you all. Um, today I would like to make this card. Uh, these cards are for my card pals. I have gained a new card pal this year, so I've got three. So I've made this one. The theme is black and white, and it's a tent card. I've also made this one for one of them. And this one opens that way. And today I'm going to make a book one. I made this card using this friendly hello from the celebration. Uh, you can get this if you order £90 worth of products and you get this free. So today I'm using this stamp this leaf stump here and this little tiny one here. Now I haven't taken them all out because I'm actually going to use my um, stamping platform. Stamp Perfect. So for this I have got a card base of eight and a quarter by five and seven eighths scored at four and one eighths. Let's move that out of the way. And I've got a piece of DSP, and guess what, I can't remember the name of it. Black and white checked one anyway. Um, oh, what's the name of it? I think it's the one from the back of the catalogue. Yeah. It is Pattern Party DSP which is a hostess pack that you get. I've also got a piece of white and this would have measured three and three quarters by three and seven eighths. No, three and three quarters. So it was three and three quarters by three and three quarters and I used the die from the ornate dies, this one to do the bottom. I've got a new way of storing my dies, which I'll tell you about later. And I've also got a scrap of white for the sentiment, which I'm going to cut out using these dies. I'm actually going to use this one. I think it's that one. Yeah, this one. Let's put that back in there. Which I will do. But first of all, we need to stamp our images. So, I'm going to use my stamping platform. And I'm going to place that there. Put the magnets there. And place my bird. Just the reason I'm using the platform is because I might need to stamp it twice, and I'm using VersaFine Onyx Blank Ink for this, as I want it to really be sharp and clear. nice but I'm going to do it again because that leaf's not very black that's lovely clear that off 
even though I'm going to use that again in another card I'm going to film in a bit. Right, my hello friend. I am going to... Where's my scrap? I'm going to stick up there. Oh, I can take this out for now. Put this down here. Someone's at my door. Right, and I'll just pick that up. Uh, and ink it up. again right I'll do one more because that L to one side to dry and then I'll cut that out clean off I should give that a proper clean afterwards right now oh I need this still We've got to add right these tiny little decorative bits. I should put one there, and then these leaves. I'm going to put. flower like that now there is supposed to be another leaf at the back This one will come out the branch just there. Like that. And that is our stamping done. So this we will stick on the black and white paper like that and we'll stick it flat. Try not to touch the ink because it will still be wet. <laughs> My glue don't work. Um, typical when you don't use your glue for a little while. This has to go even with the paper, like so. 
and let's fit this on the card base. just need to cut out our um, sentiment. What did I do with it? Oh, right in front of me. I just need to grab my machine. But I forgot to bring it down. that through. And pop this away so we don't lose it. I'm going to like this, but we'll see. And we're going to pop this up on dimensionals. Just sit in there. And did we do? We didn't do anything inside these, so we just need to. plain white piece inside like I always do to balance the card out. And then got these black gems here. I only need two one in the middle of each flower. And that is my card done. So I've got three cards. One for Sam, one for Moira and one for Jill. I hope they like them. If you like them, give us a thumbs up. And if you'd like to see more of my cards, please subscribe. And I shall be... And if you press the bell icon, you'll be notified of any more videos that I upload, which is usually a Monday and Friday for now. I did used to do them on a Wednesday, but I'm sticking to my Monday and Friday. I hope you like them. If you do, give us a thumbs up. And I hope to see you again soon.